Hey fellow riders, I'm here at 11 Woodlands Close at the premise of MFC, or better known as the Million Factory Club. Let's head in and check out the place. Hey fellow riders and viewers, welcome to another episode of Grab Adventures. After a year of using my Grab food bag, I decided to get a new food delivery bag. As my existing bag, it was actually coming apart at the shoulder straps. Furthermore, as I was delivering for Deliveroo as well, uh, I felt kind of weird uh, wearing, you know, rule colours but with the Grab fed bag at the back. Which was when I started checking around for alternative uh, food delivery bags. The moment you hit food delivery bag on Google, MFC is the website which comes up. So what is MFC stand for? MFC stands for the Million Factory Club, Singapore's most prominent food delivery bag seller. Fellow riders are I'm sure very aware of these bags. They are the black colored ones which a lot of uh, riders actually use. Their bags are universally loved by all food delivery riders. The reason why is because the founder of the company was a food delivery cyclist himself. He understood the need for a delivery bag which caters to different modes of transport such as a walker, a cyclist, a motorbike rider and even cars and different and various uh, sizes which, cat which caters to different types of uh, delivery platforms. After coming to the realization that not all food delivery riders can use the same bag, he set out to create the most efficient and most stylish uh, thermal bags of different sizes. And thus MFC was born. After checking out their website and contacting them through WhatsApp to verify if stocks were available for the version that I was looking at, I was off to purchase my bag. MFC is located at 11 Woodlands Close. The closest MRT is Admiralty MRT Station. Uh, after getting down, uh, you can just uh, turn right and turn right once again to head to the bus stop adjoining the MRT station. And uh, oh yes, there's the bus. It's bus number 901M. And uh, basically this bus ride, it will actually take you to uh, the, the doorstep of the building where MFC is located at. Wow, quite crowded. Uh. Let's just wait. It's just uh, two bus stops away. So after boarding the bus, you just need to get down at the second bus stop. All in all, it only took me about five minutes from the MRT to reach this bus stop. The bus stop number is 47559. Location is opposite block 630. After alighting, turn left and uh, just keep walking straight down this uh, pathway. Uh, oh, there's a panda mart over here. Hmm. And uh, you'll see beside the panda mart, there's uh, some sort of like a childcare center. And then uh, right beside that uh, mini garden there, there is the huge sign which says uh, Woodland uh, 11. Uh, that is the entrance to the lift, uh, lift lobby. So let's uh, head in. Uh, watch out for the traffic. And uh, wow, I can see quite a lot of uh, Grab food riders and Panda riders. Uh, they've parked their bicycles at the side over there. And let's head in. And this is the lift lobby. So let's press the button and wait for the lift. Oh, just in case I did not mention, the MFC unit is actually located on the seventh floor. The unit number is uh, 07 21. And we have reached the 7th floor, uh, so turn left and uh, you will see two doors there with, uh, okay, unit number 21, so it says turn towards the right. Okay, let's, eh? But this is staircase, eh? Alamak, I think I go wrong direction, eh? Uh, wow. Oh, oh, okay, okay, I think, I think I must go through that door first, then turn right. Yeah, okay. Oh, it's those, is this, this is kind of like a warehouse 
plus office plus showroom kind of a concept i think yeah i've seen this type of uh, of layouts before so after you enter that door right then you just uh, turn towards your right and just keep uh, walking lah we just find where is uh, unit number 0721 Okay, uh, one thing which I would like to make it very clear is that uh, this is not a paid advertisement. Uh, actually, MFC does not know that I am actually on my way to their store. Uh, they are not sponsoring me in any way. Uh, I'm just, you know, going there to buy the bags as a food delivery rider. So, uh, I thought that, you know, why not I just uh, try to see if I can film uh, my experience uh, visiting their their showroom as well as uh, how their showroom actually looks like. Uh. Uh, I'm also not sure whether they will allow me to film inside. Uh, I will try. If supposing nobody objects, then I will I will I will film lah. But if supposing they say no videography or thing like that, then I will. I guess I will have to just stop and then come out and then uh, tell you guys uh, what happened. But uh, keeping my fingers crossed, uh, I really hope that uh, they at least allow me to film their, their products or things like that. Uh, after all, I'm just a small-time uh, content creator. Uh, I don't think they have you know, heard or even know about me or my channel. So I'm not sure how they are going to react. Wow, the wow, distance uh, is quite far from the, from the door. I think I have passed already like 10-12 units. And yay, I can see the logo, Million Factory Club. I have finally reached my destination. And uh, here's the door. Okay, MFC. I don't know, uh, for some reason, uh, I see MFC. It reminds me of a football club. So, okay, never mind. Uh, so, let's go in. Hello. Hi, good afternoon. Oops. Yeah, hi. I need to purchase one of the MFC uh, oh, uh Actually, yesterday I texted. Uh, it's actually the uh, 62 liter, the Magneto version. Which one? Uh, 62 liters. Uh. 62. Yeah, the Magneto. Center. This one is it? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah, sure. This one is the 48 liters. Uh. Yeah. This is the 48 liters. This is 62. So, do you mind if I just take it down and take a look? The version I am actually interested in purchasing is the 62 liter liters uh, capacity version. Uh. The main reason why I'm I'm getting this is because uh, over at uh, my place where I do food delivery, I do get a fair bit of uh, pizza uh, deliveries. Uh. So I believe that this particular bag has uh, ample enough uh, space to fit in uh, pizza boxes, and plus the bag fits my. Uh, bicycle rack exactly the divider comes with it as well is it, it? it comes with it huh? okay. i think i can guess why they call this the magneto the magnets are very strong uh, i will test it out uh, on the back when i reach home and i really like the color it has a nice matte black finish to it so let's check the sides and uh Okay, it has some kind of loop straps and uh, there's also a, something like a sling, like a shoulder strap as well. So I guess, I don't know, could walkers use this bag? But I am, I'm not sure, man. It might be too big for them to carry around. But uh, it's a nice thought though. After confirming the bag that I wanted to purchase, I asked uh, Iverson, the staff who was attending to me, uh, whether I could take some uh, pictures of the other items. Uh, and over here you have the Fitlock series which uh, MFC represents. And uh, have you seen their TikTok videos featuring the Fitlock series of handphone mounts? Wow, they are so insane, man. And oh, look at this. It's the Wildman series of uh, bags or hard I think they are the hard shell type of bags. I've only seen them on their website. So seeing them in real life, you know, it's it's completely different from, you know, just seeing a picture on the screen. Uh, having that, you know, touch and feel of the products at their showroom, it adds a whole new uh, dimension to the products. Huh? Hmm, but I wonder why they call it Wildman. And oh yeah, this is the pump. This is quite similar to the Xiaomi air pumps that you can find from Shopee. 
Uh, however, MFC has, uh, I think, like a built-in power bank as well and uh, some other features to it. Uh, I, I can't exactly recall what is it. And uh, these are the phone mounts, you know, uh, the one-handed phone mounts. And uh, let's see what else they have. Oh, okay. This is the famous Alpaca brand of uh, pouches, waist pouches and chest pouches. Oh man, I wish I could get one of these, you know, they look so awesome, especially the camouflage one. Uh, okay, let's see what else they have over here, the entire range of delivery bags. And uh, these are the thousand helmets, right? Yeah. Wow, these are really bling, man. Wow, look at that uh, golden color bell. And uh, what well, nice matte finishes to all these helmets. I wonder what their prices are. I wonder if they are selling this Eco Drive. Uh, recently, I have been thinking about getting an e-bike, especially now that I'm doing delivery, which uh, has uh, further distances from merchants to customers. You're also selling the Eco Drive. Huh? Huh? The Eco Drive also you're selling, is it? Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Eco Drive, yeah. Oh, may I know how much is the? One four nine nine. One four nine nine. Huh? Okay, can. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, no, I'll just take this two first. Okay. Yeah. Pay now, eh? Uh, yeah. Can. Okay. Yeah. They did offer to assemble the bags for me. Uh, however, I decided to do it myself back at home. Uh. Okay, thank you so much. Thank uh. you. Okay, yeah, uh, bye-bye. Yeah. And uh, Iverson kindly helped me to find some nylon string so that I can tie them up and carry them on the train with me. And uh, actually, it went better than I expected. Uh, let me explain why. There have been times I have entered certain showrooms and the salespeople immediately start shadowing me. Every time I touch something, they come up to me and start reciting the specifications. And then when I move from product to product, they will follow me behind, even though I make it a point to tell them I am just browsing and uh, I will call for assistance if needed. When they still persist in shadowing me, uh, it makes me extremely uncomfortable. And in all likelihood, I will just simply leave the showroom. Uh, MFC, on the other hand, has a very easy to shop showroom concept uh, with uh, pretty nice and polite frontliners uh, who know their stuff and know when to offer help when needed. Uh, what I really like about the place is that the guys manning the store uh, slash warehouse slash office are really laid back and chill guys. Uh, like example, you know, when I went in, you know, after acknowledging my greeting, uh, Iverson, uh, and uh, I, I'm sorry, hey, uh, the guy sitting behind Iverson, I'm sorry, I do not know your name, uh, so forgive me uh, if you are watching this video, lah. Okay, uh, but uh, you know, they were very uh, polite and pleasant, uh, gave me quick answers to my queries, and uh, also allowed me to take a look at the bags, uh, you know, touch it, feel it and uh, generally just uh, take a good look at it. Uh. Uh, I had already done my research, uh, so I knew what I wanted. But I also took this uh, opportunity to look at their other gadgets and products at their showroom, uh, which I have only seen on their website before this. Their showcase uh, uh, features uh, almost all the gadgets and accessories from the brands they represent, such as Fitlock, Alcape, Thousand, uh, the helmet you know and their own uh, of course in-house uh, brand mfc uh, thermal delivery bags uh. now there's one thing which i would like to say i have to admit i was wrong in one aspect uh, i thought a number of their products were actually expensive to be honest but after going to their showroom and you know touching and feeling them in real life i could understand the reason for their premium price uh. the very feel of these products right they exude, you know, uh, they, 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 I, I don't know, it's hard to explain in words exactly, but basically, right, they exude design excellence, quality, workmanship, and a very luxurious feel. Uh. It's like handling and feeling an Apple product, you know. The, the feeling is very hard to, to convey in words. You just have to go there and touch the product and see it. So I am uh, very happy that I took this uh, opportunity to visit their showroom and uh, was even more pleasantly surprised by their response to me. MFC also have their online official stores on Shopee, Lazada and Carousel. Links provided below. If you like this video, do consider subscribing to my channel if you have not done so.
And we have come to the end of this episode. I will see you in another adventure soon. Ride safe, be safe.